You're listening to Insight on Capital Public Radio. I'm Pamela Wu in for Beth Ruyak. Musician Pauli Warges draws upon many influences. He blends classical training and South Indian percussion with North Indian folk and modern electric guitar technique. He performs tonight at the B Street Theater in Sacramento, where the audience will be treated to the sounds of the Mohan Veena, a stringed instrument that was invented and designed by his guru, the Grammy-winning musician Vishwa Mohan Bhatt. Poli Wargis joins us live in the Insight Studio today with local artist Jay Nair and music from the 2018 album Whispers of Trance. Thank you both for joining us today. Thank, Thank you very much. Indeed, Thank welcome you. to Insight. Poli, I see that you are holding on your lap the Mohan Vina. So yes. for those who can't see it because they're listening on the radio, how would you describe the instrument? Uh, this is a combination of uh, several five instruments that invited my, my guru, Pandit Vishwam Mohan, but uh, more than uh, 50 years back, when he was uh, 20 years old, seems. So this instrument is combination of sitar and uh, sarangi, sandhur, and slide guitar, and, uh, 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 sa- uh, and, and sarod, and several instruments is combination. It has 22 strings. Actually. 22 strings. Exactly. And I, it looks as though it has two layers of strings parallel to one another. Three layers of strings. Three under. layers. Yeah, yeah. This is the, the, the main uh, string is four, and the sec- second layer is having a five strings, and the third layer is called sympathetic strings. Sympathetic strings. Yeah, the 14 strings are there. Wow. Yeah. Tell me about meeting your guru and how that led to your falling in love with the Mohan Veena. Exactly. It's a long time back. Uh, actually, uh, with music, my life is going on with 40 years. Uh, since eight years old, I'm with Indian classical music. So I was a South Indian musician. I started with the South Indian percussion and the South Indian vocal. But later my life, when I was studying in Kerala, Kalamandala, one of the prestigious university today in, uh, in Kerala, so coincidentally I was listening, that was the Indian Doordarshan, National Network, television media, it came to villages. So coincidentally I was listening, my guru is playing, so I was mesmerized, who is this guy? So I want to ma- catch him. So I was inquiring where he lives. And uh, I was getting away from my uh, home, very young age, I was mostly 20, 22 years old. So I went to the Calcutta. So I was only knowing Calcutta where exactly that. So, But my guru lives in uh, Rajasthan, that is the eastern part of India. From there I was catching him, inquiring him. And I got him in Calcutta while he came to for the concert. Since that era, I am with him now, more than 25 years Wow. Jay, you accompany Polly with vocals. What is it like to sing along with this special instrument? Yeah, it is. I like it very much because um, uh, one of the main thing about this instrument is how um, the artist uh, Polly um, moves from one note to another is very, uh, very interesting. It actually directly touches your nervous system. <laughs> wow! <laughs> you know, so then that, that's the kind of music I like. I I try to sing where the music directly goes into you and not not to your thought process or something. So it's a good combination for me to um, sing my kind of music with Mohan Veena. Will you play a song for us? Yes. Definitely. This is Poli Wargis. Live in our inside studio with local artist Jay Nair.
You are listening to a live performance on Insight by musicians Polly Wuggies and Jay Nair. They're performing live tonight at B Street Theater in Sacramento. That sounded amazing in the studio. Thank you. Yeah, Thank you. Did that come from your album titled Whispers of Trance, Polly? Yeah. How would you describe that album's sound? Uh, it belongs to uh, uh, silent, actually. We are, yeah, we are oh. searching. The, every musician is searching for the silent mm. through the sound. The basement of our life, it is extremely silent. All sounds are the translation of the silence or interpretations of the silence. So between two nodes, if there is a small gap, that is called silent. Mm. If there is no silent, there is no music at all. So myself... I consider this album that personally the musician is inquiring his inner inner journey in soul, whereas extreme silence of the life. This is the my way. You can see the lullabies of the silence, and different different track are there. So all track art belongs to silent. Jay, can what can people expect at tonight's performance? Um, tonight. Um you know, at the Sophia at 7 p.m. tonight, we are actually we are giving a buffet, <laughs> a buffet, of, <laughs> buffet of different styles of Indian music. Um, uh, there will be pure some pure Hindustani, pure uh, classical music. There will be some fusion. There will be some folk music, and we are also improvising. So. Um, we have some idea of what's going to be, but there are parts we have no idea what's going to be. So it's kind of a buffet. You'll get um, audience will get to taste um, a little bit of um, you know the the whole range of Indian raga system. Uh, the raga system is that um, you know the scales that of Indian music where it directly touches. Uh, we are as spontaneous musicians, actually. Indian music, the history of Indian music is spontaneous music. We never planned anything. So on this part, we are dedicating our life to the listeners, or uh, who are li- watching us. So it, it, this is the Indian classical structure. So today, Sophia Center in Sacramento is going to happening over there. Our spontaneous life through the sound and silence. I love what you're saying about the silence yeah. and its contrast. It's being part of the music exactly. and also about how it's spontaneous. It's like a conversation with the audience exactly. and what exactly. the energy is at the time. Yeah. Would you play another song for us? Definitely. This is Polly Wurgis and Jay Nair who are performing tonight at the B Street Theater at the Sophia in Sacramento.
That's gorgeous music by musician Polly Borghese with Jay Nair. They are performing tonight at the B Street Theater, and we have event and ticket information at our website, capradio.org slash insight. Thank you both for joining us, and best wishes for a great show tonight. Thank you. Thank you very much. I am welcoming all of you to the Sophia Center, Sacramento. Tonight at 7. Tonight. Tonight at 7. That is Insight for today. I'm Pamela Wu in for Beth Ruyak. Insight is produced by Jen Picard, Burt Johnson, and Cody Drapple. Our digital team is Chris Hagen, Casey Gardner, and Emily Zentner. Our technical director is Mark Jones. Our theme music was composed by Joe Gilman and Paul Conley. Insight's executive producer is Joe Barr. We are back with another live show on Monday. Thank you for joining us. <laughs>